I challenged my best friend to see who can pull this sword out of 5,000 pounds of concrete. The first person to do it wins $10,000. We will both go head to head in a series of challenges and the winner will choose between two weapons to break the concrete. Each person will have 10 minutes with their weapon to try to make as much damage as possible before moving on to the next challenge. The tools will get more and more advanced throughout the video to help you get closer to that sword. Who do you guys think will win? Your boy or Mr. Simplistic? Let's get right into it. All right, Noah, you ready? Oh, I've been ready. All right, so this is what we're starting with. We got a giant spoon to chip away at this 5,000 pounds of concrete. I'm gonna be eating right now, baby, come on. It's honestly not gonna do much, but every 10 minutes, we're gonna be competing in a challenge against each other, and each challenge that we win will get us an upgraded weapon to help get that sword out. All right, you ready? Been ready. Like that me up? Oh, yeah. Yo guys, the best part about this challenge is that Noah and I are literally built the same. Literally look at us. We weigh the same, we look the same, we're brothers from another mother. People really think we're related. Exactly, so it might be. this will be an interesting finish. Hey, but I'm gonna show you guys why I'm built different. Oh my god, this is literally not gonna do it. See, my main thing is consistency is key. Like everything in life, you know what I'm saying? You see the crack right there? It's already cracking by the sword, so I'm gonna attack that. Yeah, the spoon is already bending, bro. So I'm going chips ahoy on this real quick. This is not gonna do anything I'm telling you guys right now, but you know, I'm gonna do what I can with it. Oh, look, I'm chipping away, bro. Just to show you guys how stuck this is, there's literally no way. Yeah, I think we need better weapons. I think we definitely need better weapons. All right, you wanna get into the first challenge? Please. This is the Mandela Effect Challenge. There are two logos with one slight difference. You have to guess the correct logo and the winner gets to choose between a crowbar or a baseball bat. I already know what I'm choosing. I'm choosing the crowbar. Me too. The loser will get the other weapons. The person with the most points wins. Three, two, one, go. All right, Rug. It's the right one. That is correct. Yes. One point, baby, let's go. Yeah, it's always been with the little circles. Three. Two, one, go. Wait. Noah. The right one's the correct one. That is correct. I was gonna say the dash. One to one, baby. Three, two, one, go. All right, I think that was rug. Yeah. Oh my God, it, it has to be the one with no T. Is that your final answer? Yeah. You're correct. Oh my gosh. Damn. Wow, dude, because usually everything else would be spelt with like TCH. I like your sketchers. You like me, my Gucci shoes. Three, two, one, go. Right. Come on. It's with the black at the tail. You're incorrect. Wow. Wait, are you serious? Wait, Pikachu doesn't have the black he on there. He doesn't have the black. That's the Mandela effect. I always thought he had the black at the end. No, it gets the point. All right, two to two. This is the tiebreaker. Next point wins. I need that crowbar, baby. I'll do some damage. Oh, man. Three, two, one, go. Is there even a difference on this? No. Noah. The left one is correct. Why? It's tunes, like a cartoon. Final point goes to Brian. What? Yes! Correct. Yes! Really? Wait! Damn. Oh, this is gonna do some damage. Wow. But hey, Noah, at least you got the baseball bat. Bro, what am I gonna do, hit a home run? I mean, you're upgrading from the spoon, bro. Wait. Yeah. Oh yeah, dude, you need some gloves for this one. <laughs> oh no, dude, no way. Chipping away, little by little. This one's for you, yep. <laughs> Let's go, baby. <sighs> this ain't doing anything, bro. Oh yeah, oh my gosh. I think I need to start attacking where the sword is. Hey, but I already see a little chip coming to fall off right here. Come on. Yeah, some damage. This is so tiring, guys. It's 100 degrees right now too. I might be able to pull it out now, guys. All right, it's your boy Simplistic. You know we're gonna get it. I don't give a and you know I'm gonna hit it. Oh my god. Dude, I thought this was gonna do way more damage. Yeah, that seems to be doing some more damage. All right, that's time for 
Put your weapons down. Bro, I can't feel my arms right now. They're like noodles. Same, bro. <laughs> Holy crap. It looks like we both did some damage in the first bro, 10 minutes. You went crazy. Guys, so my first tactic was to go towards the middle, but I figured that if I started on the side and worked my way in, that might be the easiest bet. So this is my damage done in the first 10 minutes. Show me what you did. I got a little chunk right here off. Ooh. Little guy right there, and then uh, kind of worked from this side, but with the bat, bro, is low-key kind of hard. Yeah, I was gonna say, you did get the worst weapon. So. I got the sweet spot on it, though. You can feel it, like. Like, that's the home run hit right there? Yeah, that's the home run hit right okay. there. All right, I think it's time for the second challenge and upgrade our weapons even more. Let's do it. For this next challenge, the winner will choose between a mini sledgehammer slash chisel, which or I think is good. A shovel. I think they'll both do some good damage, but the challenge is the throwing stones at Sherman the Vermin's face challenge. Yes. Yeah, we've all been waiting for this Bro, moment. Can we do this in real life? So each of us are gonna take turns and whoever hits the most targets wins. Sounds good. Mine's enchanted by the way, this shovel. So I'm gonna get the shovel for sure. All right, I guess I'll go first because I won the first challenge, yeah? I guess that makes sense. It's like a carnival game. I know. <laughs> I wish Sherman's face was moving. Oh, that's one baby. That counts. Let's go. The accuracy though. Oh, a big rock for a big head. <laughs> we'll count it. We'll count it. We'll count it. Oh no! One to one. Oh, clean. That was good. Two to one. All right, let's go. Two to two, baby. Okay. Are right, you not even gonna be able to reach it? Watch. Okay. We're gonna count <laughs> we'll it. We'll count it. We'll count it, man. Okay. Three to two. Oh, yes, sir. that was clean. Three to three. There's two more. Light and easy. Dang. Oh, that counts. Four to three. <laughs> if you hit this, you win. Whoa. I just need my revenge on Noah. Imagine I missed the whole thing. <laughs> All right. Yeah. GG's, baby. Let's go. You already know what I'm choosing. This has to do some damage. I need to start winning some challenges. Here we go. Let's see the damage I could do. Is it doing anything? Dude, hold up. From a bat to a shovel, I really don't think I upgraded, but you know, let's get to digging. <laughs> Bro, this is not fair. Oh, oh. I think you really have to go from the side or any of these edges, because the middle, it's hard to get a good angle. Bro, how did cavemen do this back in the day? I swear. Bro, like this actually did way more damage than I thought and it's only the second round. So imagine the more upgraded weapons. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, we definitely spent more than 10 minutes on this. Yeah, definitely. But um, Noah, let's check yours out real quick. If you guys wanna see nothing, Noah, see right here. all I'm gonna say, for you to win this challenge, you literally need to win the next challenges. He has to win, bro. To. I'm guessing the weapons are gonna get really advanced, right? Really advanced and things that will actually cut through the concrete. Like a shovel and a bat. But guys, this is way harder than it looks. Like, imagine 5,000 pounds of concrete. Concrete. Bro, we're talking concrete stuff that's like used for bridges literally, <laughs> but I think it's time for the next challenge Please bro. So for this challenge the loser actually gets a sledgehammer we meaning can't hear you bro The loser of this next challenge gets a sledgehammer meaning there's a better weapon in this pile of bark We have two shovels first person to find that weapon gets to use it for the next round. Okay, you ready? Yep. All right you know, my mom asks me sometimes, like, son, what do you usually do on your day to day? <laughs> I'm shoveling bark right now. <laughs> I have no idea what the weapon's gonna be, but if it's better than that mini sledgehammer, it's fire. Oh! Oh! No. Wait, no, no, no! Bro, I need that weapon! Hey! Dude! Yes, sir! We got a pickaxe! Let's go! Dude, this is gonna do so much damage. Oh my god. Sorry, Noah. Hey, honestly, you get a sledgehammer. That's gonna do damage. Noah, Give here you it, go, bro. man. Give me it. Alright, let's see what this bad boy can do. Whoa. Okay. Bro, you're gonna do so much damage. Oh yeah. Dude, I feel like I'm in Fortnite. Or Minecraft. This is a workout and a half, bro. Yo, respect to anyone that works in construction, bro. Oh my gosh. Woo. I just want to give a newfound respect to to Egyptians because they built pyramids. <laughs> they did. Think about that. Go for it. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. 
Okay. Noah, I'm gonna give you an extra 20 minutes with this one. Really? I just want you to do some more damage, bro. bro please. Me? Thank you for giving me a chance. So you're starting with this, going to the middle? I have to. I've been working on this side the whole time. Okay. <laughs> How do people handle these things? I'm gonna be sore tonight. You got this, bro. Ah! 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 We're kind of getting there. Oh my gosh. I'm so tired, bro. So guys, look at this. We are getting closer and closer to the center. Guys, as of right now, it is still obviously just lodged in there, bro. Like, I wonder if I get to here, do I have to go all the way around? I don't know, we're gonna have to wait and see. Noah, what about you? Let's just do the next challenge. Hey, you did a lot of damage, bro. Holy. We're gonna move on to the last and final challenge, and hopefully someone pulls the sword out of this freaking concrete. I definitely need to win these next challenges, like, without a doubt. It's one more. Challenge. <laughs> I don't know Guys, we're saying. so out of it. The final challenge. We are gonna be jousting. First person to fall off loses, and the winner gets to choose between a concrete saw or a jackhammer. Both of these are gonna do extreme amount of damage. It's all about how fast you can get to the center of that concrete block. Comeback season, baby, comeback season. How are we gonna fall off from these inflatables? What? Hey! All right, ready, set, go. <laughs> no! Hey! No! Come on, baby. Guys, I'm literally not even stressing. <laughs> like, look at how close I am to the center. All right, Noah, what is your weapon of choice? Probably with the saw. The oh. saw? Over the oh, jackhammer? Only because the jackhammer, you kind of have to like go on top of the thing, right? Luckily, Luckily you can kind of just like. You and I are not even gonna be operating those because we need professionals for that. Thank goodness. So each of us are gonna be assigned a professional who's gonna use the tools for us and they're gonna help us get to the middle, but we still have to be the ones to pull the sword. Okay, all Sounds right. Good to so me. you're choosing the concrete saw? Yes, I'm Hercules. All right, I got my boy Tony here. Yo. You're gonna get me to the sword, right? Of course, man. All right, Come on. let's do it. Man, who else other than Charlie? Come on now. Dude, how come we're so far behind this guy right here? Bro, we have a lot to catch up, but at the same time, we're gonna win. I just have to give a reminder out there, do not try this at home. Not that any of you guys were probably gonna do this, but don't try it at home. We have professionals right here. <laughs> We got him in position. This is it. May the best team member win. In three, two, one, go! Hey, right here, yes! Go, go! Oh! Yes, sir! We're getting closer to the sword. What do you think, bro? I think we're getting closer, bro. It looks like Wolverine came in here. Oh my god. Here you go. Here you go. Oh. oh! Dude, we're going, we're going Watch hard. Watch the power! Oh, we might have a chance. Oh! Dude, the saw loosened it so much that when the sledgehammer hits it, it just explodes now. <laughs> Look at that. Oh yeah. We gotta just keep chipping at it. Good progress, though. Okay, let's do it. Oh, oh bro, they just got a huge piece off. Here, tag me in, tag me in. Oh, let's go. Let's go, Charlie. Oh, it's close. Guys, look at how close we are to getting the sword out. We definitely damaged it, as you could see. Tony, what do you think? Like, it's like lodged in there, like it bent, right? Yeah, I think a couple more inches, we'll get there. It's moving. It's moving, so that's progress. How are you guys doing? Are you guys giving up at this point? I mean, oh, look at our side. Dude, all right, Tony, let's get it, guys. This is the final stretch. Let's do it. No way! Oh! Oh! <laughs> is this it? I mean, the whole thing is just absolutely obliterated. Noah, did you actually think you had a chance? I mean, no, but that's crazy that it looks like that. Guys, wait, I don't know if this is the full sword. The rest of it's in there, but what, it's stuck? It's gone? It's stuck, it's not. 
Look, it's not moving. The rest of the sword is in there, so Noah, I'm gonna ask you the question. Do we take the dub or are we disqualified? Easy DQ. What? Yeah, 1000%. You didn't even do anything. Both of you guys didn't do anything. Look at ours, bro. Look how far we go. We're so close. No, I'm just kidding. You guys definitely won. Really? We're gonna count this as yeah, a dub? Bro, look at you. You're holding it. Good <laughs> Bro. Wow. Both of you guys, you hey, crazy. Shout out to Charlie, <laughs> Tony. Woo! Where's my 10K? <laughs> yeah. Woo! Let's go. Well deserved. Hey, well, you know, I couldn't do this without Tony. You deserve the 10K, man. Oh my God, thank you. <laughs> yes, we got the sword out. I thought we were going to be here all day and night. Shout out to Noah and Charlie for competing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed, and we'll see you all with the next video. Peace.